Preparing your child for university sexual misconduct hearing in Maryland needs to take place as early as possible in the process. As soon as the college or university notifies the accused student, the respondent that is, of the allegations against him or her, you have to bear in mind the prospect of a hearing. When the accused student responds to the allegations, it needs to be done as effectively as possible. It can be challenged or will be challenged at a later time. Anything that would support the accused student's version of events would need to be presented to the school at the appropriate time, be it witnesses and witness statements, documentary evidence, expert reports may need to be obtained. Prior to the hearing itself, an investigation report will be prepared and will be presented to the hearing panel. It will be reviewed by the hearing panel. So prior to the hearing taking place, the hearing panel will have a good understanding of the case. That's why the, it's critical that the investigation report be as strong as possible. An opening and closing statement, questions for the witnesses, the complainant, the respondent, applicable cross-examination questions is, would need to be prepared for purposes of the hearing. And there has to be oversight and accountability for the hearing process and hearing panel. An experienced attorney advisor can help you best prepare and defend if your son or daughter is facing a university sexual misconduct hearing in Maryland.